A year after making the NCAA tournament, Jay DeRoche has the Castlin women's basketball team off to a 2-0 start to the new season. And thanks to her late heroics in last year's matchup, Castlin has won back-to-back -back games versus last night's visiting opponent, Middlebury. The Panthers also entered play last night with two wins in as many games. Those last two matchups have been right to the end. The Spartans winning both contests by a single basket. How will last night go? First half, Sabrina Weeks is going to get the scoring started. Hitting the long jumper from the side. Middlebury strikes first. Weeks had a dozen points in the game. DeRoche then made her impact known early on. The Spartans' first field goal puts her team up 3-2. to two. We go back to the other side. Middlebury taking the lead back again. Rachel Cruz. She scored five straight points in all eight of her points in the game in a matter of two and a half minutes. Middlebury would start to pull away. Then DeRoche pulls the ball right out of midair. Stops, pops, hits. She scored 15 on the night. Spartans would get on a run. Megan O'Sullivan getting the ball just outside the paint. Steps back, hits the jumper. She chipped in with 16 points. Castleton ended the half on a 12-6 run that included a huge three from Allie Jones. Getting the gym excited, helping Castleton try to make the comeback. It would fall a little short, but the Panthers would stay up, thanks in part to Elizabeth Knox. Game high, 22. They break up that mini losing streak with another two-point game of their own.